Hi guys, my name is Elena Semenek and welcome to my channel Psychology of Happiness, where happiness is the purpose of life. Today's topic is why are people rude? Why are people mean? Why are people so disrespectful? Why are people insulting each other? Uh, if you want to learn how to talk to rude, disrespectful people, I have a separate video and I will leave the link to that video uh, below in the description box. Make sure to watch it. Today I will talk about the reasons why are people mean to each other. Why are people so rude? There are four reasons. At the end of this video, you will understand why are people behaving in this specific way. And maybe you will understand yourself why sometimes you are rude, why sometimes you feel this anger and the desire to be disrespectful towards a person. So let's start. Why are people mean? Why are people so rude? Reason number one. There are two types of aggressions. Uh, direct aggression and hidden aggression. So the first reason is direct aggression. So for example, when two people are arguing and one person wants to prove that he or she is right, wants to prove his opinion, uh, he or she is raising uh, his voice and he's trying to tell you like listen to me he's trying to prove his opinion by raising his voice and if the uh, other person is not listening if the other person uh, is not paying attention then uh, the person might become rude the person might use like sharp words or maybe disrespectful actions kind of to show that you know listen to me like I'm talking to you, respect me, uh, agree with me, like, you know, my point is uh, uh, the proper one, uh, I am right. The second reason why people are so rude, why people are so mad is a hidden aggression. Uh, for example, uh, when a boss is um, rude with their employee and the employee does not know how to respond, uh, he's coming back home with all his stressful and nervous uh, feelings inside and he might be rude to his wife or to his girlfriend and he's using sharp words or maybe disrespectful behavior or maybe he is mean with his wife and his wife when she sees like her husband is screaming at her at some point she might not be able to reply and she is going to a bedroom and there is a child. A child is misbehaving. So she's uh, angry, but she's not angry with the child. She's angry because her husband was rude. So she's expressing her anger uh, with child. And the child is going outside and he's rude and mean to other kids. Or he's going to school and he's mean to other kids at school. Or maybe with a pet. So this type of aggression is a hidden aggression when you cannot express your feelings, when you're keeping your feelings inside, sometimes pretending that uh, you ignoring it, but they are inside you. And when you go to the world, you're expressing it to the person who has nothing to do with your feelings. So that's why it's very important to know how to properly respond to rude people. Uh, again, I will um, put a link somewhere here or in the description box below how to respond to rudeness. Um, let's talk about the third reason why people are so mean and why people are so rude. There are people who are always victims. People who are always uh, victims of circumstances. Uh, they always complaining about other people. They always complain about uh, uh, politics. They always complain about the morality in this world. They always complain about everything and everyone. And at some point they have so much complaints so they become angry. They become angry and they like to find another victim for their anger. And 
you will know right away that you are with such person if you feel guilty. So these people, uh, they try to put guilt on you. So it's like they're saying, I am angry because you did not listen to me. I am angry because I'm screaming because you did not pay attention to me. I'm screaming because you made me feel this way. So they're angry at everyone and everything. And they're making you feel bad because they're putting guilt on you. And the reason number four why people are so mean and rude and disrespectful to others is because of jealousy. They jealous. They jealous because you have a better house. They jealous because you have a better job, better boyfriend, better girlfriend, better body, better purse, uh, better friends. So they feel that you are better than them. And because they feel uh, this way, they have to, they have, they, they desire, they have a desire to put you down. So by putting you down, they, are, they feel better. They bring themselves up. So they, uh, they have to put you down. So to prove themselves that they're not as low as they think they are. So they putting you down, bringing themselves up and they feel good. And they usually have to be angry. They usually have to be mean because they cannot just put you a little bit down. They need to put you a lot, a lot down. So it makes them feel better, uh, smarter, uh, more successful. So this is kind of, they build their own self-esteem, their self-confidence. When those people are putting you down, they don't feel miserable anymore they don't feel as bad as it was before so they saying like okay you have a good house but you're so fat they feel that they are less successful than you are less successful in life less happy in life than you are so they need to find something they kind of are looking of the opportunity to put you down so they're looking for reason to explain themselves why they're better than you now you know four reasons why are people mad, why are people rude, why are people disrespectful. Maybe you will understand yourself better and maybe you will decide that some people should not be in your life. Check the links below the video and learn how to respond to rude people. Uh, learn how to eliminate the disrespectful behavior in your life. Uh, share this video on your Facebook, Twitter, share it with your friends, write your comments, questions below. Your question might be the topic of the next video. Click thumbs up for this video, subscribe to my channel, click the bell icon and thank you for watching Psychology of Happiness, where happiness is the purpose of life.